Okay, so what's this man? This is the sheriff. Hey, we're supposed to be in here learning about the jail. We're not learning about yeah, the visitor. Over there learning about that one in jail cell. This is the sheriff. I was looking for your density. Oh, here's my mom. Oh, here's another sheriff. Sheriff there. Charles. Another sheriff Charles. Unless that's him. Ooh, look, this is what they used to use. You go here. I found your new place you go to in New Mexico. I think that thing's going to fill through it. Yeah, we're on a field trip. He's like, how's it going? Oh, it's going good. I'm Asian, so I'm great. Yeah, you guys can eat. Why can't you? The grants. Oh, well, I don't want to eat. You yell at me. Paying your trip today, Mom. Yeah, you know, I'm going to get my food. I'm going to New Mexico, where the Rio Grande River curves northward. President Thomas Jefferson, St. Louis Purchase. There's a cave. Oh, look at this mall. Look at this mall. Look at this mall. Look at this mall. Socorro, Lower Valley, El Paso, it Texas. Is. Somewhere. I don't know. It's not near us. What is it? Say. I don't know where it's headed. Secretary of State John Quincy Adams. Oh, Let me see that. I think we've been there. Where we did we go we here? No, we didn't. We didn't do this. No, we didn't do that. But they we have all this stuff here. We went to Carlsbad. We went to Carlsbad. This ain't it because this ain't in our town. This ain't in El Paso. Neither is Carlsbad. Like that's not anywhere near. That's near oh, San that's Antonio, right? It's, it's all over there near San Antonio. Because be right, right? The word? Yeah, because. That's where it's at. It's all over there near San Antonio. Dad says the electric bill's going up. I think because the weather's getting warmer. Air conditioner's on more. Water park. Where's that at? New Borglyph in Texas. No, that's not here. Where that's at? What is this? I have no idea. That's I that. Don't know. She got dead. I found it. I don't know what this place is called at all. If that's it. The that's natural bright bridge oh. carvings. Sheila would love that. That's Where's what that it is. Look at it, don't, it doesn't yes, say. It does. It's in Texas. San Antonio. It, it doesn't say San Antonio. Yeah. Shelby, if you don't shut up, I'm going to tie you to this chair. Hey, bring sit We're going to tie you and yeah. torture you in this chair. Shelby, the judge is in the house. Anybody going to donate? I'll put a dollar in. This has a lot to do with um, the Louisiana Purchase. Oh, man. Billy the Kid was wanted. Yeah, I remember that. Oh my god. Yeah, this has a lot to do with stuff we learned in school. Wait, wait, are you allowed to go in there and close it? I don't know. Because I want a picture in there. Oh my god. Oh my Okay, god. get get in there. No. And I'm gonna take a picture of you. According to the legend, William H. Boney, famed outlaw Billy the Kid, freed the only man to ever escape from the old El Paso County Jail in late November 1976. He was dancing and everything. Yeah. yeah. That just shows you what it is. You there? Cotton field. This is a cotton field. Cotton field. Oh, we can go back here. What's back here? I'm not sure, but there's the stairs. Oh. Ow, ow, ow. We're over. We're. It's just somebody's house back. We're now. over here now. We got done see. with the. Oh, oh, they got new animals there. They got. They got a pot belly pig. pig. She's so cute. Camels. Her name was Oreo. Huh? She was so cute. 
That pig was so friendly. She was like excited to see people. Okay. Woo. The Borgio Gallery. Ack Gallery. The Silver Dollar. Yeah, Mom, the sign said restaurant. It said restroom. Most tours. First party of the month. First party of the month. We're going to come. Most tours. We got to come. Oh, watch out. They're coming. Watch out. Oh, that is so pretty. Smells good in here. I thought that was a picture of just Jesus. <laughs> no disrespect. I'm not disrespecting. These are veteran, veterans. Yeah. Yeah, these are the Korean War era. Well, that one's different. These are all Korean people. No, not this one. This one is the Vietnam. Oh, this, this one Korean. is Korean. That one. Wow, Shelby, look at his glasses. Huh? Ooh, those are different. Hey, he knew how to take selfies back in the day. He flexed it. He knew how to take these selfies. And then these, I guess, are, no, these are veterinarians killed in actions, missing in action, persons of war. Their courage, they stood out. These are the people who stood out. Wow. Then he must be powerful in his life. Like they had to put him on a blanket. Don't touch that, but that's, this is not touch it. Oh my God, look at this. This is all they ate. Salt and fruit. And a lemon, that's it. And then they have the Holy Bible at the table. Now here's some more people. He died now a few long ago. He died back in 2015. He's in the military, 2006, 2015. Yeah, he must be real popular because look, they got them all. Um. <laughs> hey mom, please take a soldier. What? Please take a soldier. Please take a soldier. What do you want? It it says, please please take a soldier. For a man and woman who serve oh. our community Thena. country. Thena. Yeah, these will be yeah. Athena. Athena serving, so we'll take a Because soul. it says, said, take place a it somewhere that reminds you. Oh, reminds me of Athena. That too. It reminds you to pray for oh. the soldier. Where's your soldier? Yeah, we're having fun. We're good. We got one. You got one from my. I'll let you go. I wanted to tell you. Okay. Yeah, it says you place it somewhere that reminds you to pray Please for Please do not them. touch the candle. Yeah. Dad just said the electric bill was going up, but I said it's coming. Yeah, it's. That's her food they ate. That's what they ate back there. Lemon and salt. Or sugar, whatever that is. That looks like salt, maybe. I don't know. Okay. You want to see his glasses? Look at his glasses. Elvis, sir. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Elvis Presley. <laughs> Their sheriff died. Yeah. He was stylish. Look at him. Mm. He died recently, April 8th. Well, here's a place. Uh, is that next door? Oh, I don't know. Wings and more. I'll, You'll have see. to look it up. I don't know. Our fla our wing flavor: original hot, hot honey lemon pepper, honey pepper, buffalo honey hot barbecue, spicy barbecue, honey barbecue, chipotle raspberry, sweet chili, sweet chili fire, and mango hybrids. For five wings. They're 
What is it? It says it's open. It's a museum. Free admission. Open it. Is this a museum? Yeah, it says right there. That's when Don Juan de Oñate came through here on his way to colonize New Mexico. This is where he had La Toma, where he proclaimed all the land for the King of Spain. Went on to New Mexico, colonized New Mexico in 1680. The Indians revolted against the Spaniards. We had three field trips this morning. And what I told them was, if you want to know how long ago this happened, subtract the year from 2019 and you'll know how many years ago. Okay, so in 1680, the Indians revolted against the Spanish. The majority of the survivors retreated to this region. And when they retreated back, they brought Tigua Indians from Isleta, New Mexico, to our Isleta. So that's the oldest mission in Texas. They brought Pino and Tompino Indians from Socorro, New Mexico, to our Socorro. And that's the second oldest mission in Texas. And those are, I don't know if you've been to them yet. They're right down Socorro Road and uh, six and nine miles mm -hmm. and then no, a third no. mission you haven't gone okay and then a third mission was established uh, uh four miles southwest of here yeah, now um after um after the spaniards were here for a while they decided to relocate so they moved over close to the Seneca Indians, a third mission four miles from here and that's where they made the residence. Now, one of those Spaniards in 1724 returned to the region and he constructed, he started a very large hacienda. He lived here with 157 people, which consisted of uh, servants as well as his family. And so after he was here for a few years, he started getting Mescalero Apache attacks and he decided to move to Socorro, which is six miles down the road. At that point, because all this is New Spain back then, it's not the U.S. and Mexico, it's all New Spain, they decide to move the Spanish fort called the Presidio, they decided to move it here. Oh. When they moved it here, we didn't get a mission like Socorro, Isla, and Senecu. We got a chapel because mission is to Christianize. Chapel for those already Christian. They were soldiers oh, were Catholic. Catholic, okay? So a chapel was built. Now, it did have very high walls. It had a, a wall right behind this building and a wall right behind the White House across the street was the back wall. And so um, after 52 years of service, the, the Presidio Fort closed because the Apaches were at peace. They had pretty much intermarried with the Spaniards as well as the tribes along the mission trail. They were at peace, so they closed the Presidio now, when the, when the fort closed, the Presidio fort closed, they took the adobes from the walls and constructed these buildings. I thought buildings. we learned about that. Okay, constructed these buildings be, um, because the community began to grow. Now, the, um, the adobes, you can see how thick some of them were. Oh, yeah. That see how thick? was like that other field trip. Yeah, that, that's, um, that would have been from the uh, wall right behind this building. The uh -huh. outer wall, the adobes were not so thick. They were only about that thick okay but these were the the which was uh, the wall closer to the it was like better protection having a thicker wall but the other one in the back they were not as as, uh, as wide and so then as you're walking around that road that's right there uh-huh that curves around and then follows Glorietta to Socorro is the oldest road in the United States wow. okay we're going to be a you we're applying to be a UNESCO site to be recognized nationally. Oh, wow. Okay, right now we are recognized by the state and the nation, but we're trying to go international. That's cool. And um, and so um, as a community, so as you're walking around, the buildings that you see that are white, they have a statue or statues. They have adobes from the old. Oh, okay. Okay. And 
and as I mentioned, they are the oldest. So uh, as you're walking around, just keep that in mind. Keep in mind oh. that you're looking at the oldest oh, okay. buildings. You're walking along the oldest road in the United States. The name of it is El Camino Real, the Camino Real. And it connects all the way to Mexico and then all the way to Santa Fe, right yeah. north of Santa Fe, New Mexico. That's neat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's uh, very interesting that we have the oldest part of the road here, which is in the United States. Wow. Um, and so um, we, after we became a town, is when Billy the Kid, well, we became the county seat, and then in 1876, Billy the Kid broke his friend out of the jail. Yep. 77, saw war happen, the only battle that Texas Rangers have ever lost. And then it just grew into a community, uh, and um, the community used to haul salt from 90 miles over by Guadalupe Pass, which they sold to the mines in Mexico. But once the mines closed in Mexico, then they became farmers. That's well, the Okay. Yes. And so I do have a short video if you'd like to watch it. Okay. okay. In two weeks, the first weekend in June, we're going to have the ability to.